Build the perfect midsection with this no-nonsense routine. Hey there, fitness enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel, Fitness Fusion. 11-line abs are the pinnacle of a lean, strong, and fit body. It refers to those head-turning vertical lines that run down your midsection when you have serious core definition, which creates the illusion of the number 11. But what's the best way to get that look in your torso? We're here to help you out with the ultimate core workout for 11-line abs. If you've ever dreamt of rocking those jaw-dropping 11-line abs, you're in for a treat today. Because in this video, we're diving into the ultimate number one core workout that's going to sculpt your abs like never before. All right, before we jump into the workout, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our awesome fitness content. And if you're ready to put in the work for those killer abs, let's get started. First and foremost, you have to strip enough body fat to reveal the ab muscles underneath. That's non-negotiable. But even if you become lean enough, you still need specific training to create the 11. That's because the vertical lines are actually the gap between your rectus abdominis, your six pack muscles, and your internal and external obliques, the muscles toward the side of your torso. Most people, unfortunately, only target their six pack muscles with hundreds of crunches, but neglect the other muscles. Instead, you need to target your core from all directions so you get the complete look Workout, segment one, warm up. Every great workout starts with a killer warm up. Let's get that blood pumping and those muscles ready to rock. Start with some light jogging in place, followed by dynamic stretches like arm circles and leg swings. Remember, a warmed up body is a happy body. Now it's time to torch those abs. We've got a series of exercises lined up that are going to target your core from every angle. Grab a mat, some water, and let's begin. Exercise number one. Bicycle crunches. We're kicking things off with the classic bicycle crunches. Engage your abs and alternate touching your elbow to the opposite knee. Keep a steady pace and really feel those muscles contracting. Let's go for three sets of 15 reps each side. Exercise number two, plank variations. Planks are fantastic for building core strength. Start with a regular plank, then transition to side planks for that extra oblique love. Hold each plank for 30 seconds and repeat three times. Exercise number three, leg raises. Time to give those lower abs some attention. Lie down on your back, hands under your hips, and slowly lift your legs up towards the ceiling. Lower them down without letting them touch the ground. That burn means it's working. Aim for four sets of 12 reps. Point to be noted. To keep things interesting, grab a partner if you can. Fitness is always more fun when you're not sweating it alone. Let's move on to exercise number four, dead bugs. Dead bugs are a simple and effective way to blast your entire core. Then, when you extend your arm and your leg, exhale as hard as you can and hold that position for a second or two before you inhale. Obliques help with exhalation so you get added work by doing this. Workout segment two, cool down. You've just crushed that core workout, but we're not done yet. Cooling down is crucial to prevent muscle soreness and injury. Gentle stretches like the cat cow, hamstring stretches, and child's pose will work wonders. And there you have it, folks, the number one core workout to get those coveted 11 line abs. Remember, consistency is key, so make sure to include this routine in your regular fitness regimen. If you enjoyed this workout, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment below on how those abs are feeling. And thanks for joining me today. Stay motivated, stay active, and I'll catch you in the next video. Until next time, take care.